Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. For those of you who watch this channel for a lot of U.S. immigration updates, which we will continue to be doing those as they arise, and we'll try to make some general videos on Thai law, but as we're getting into sort of the home stretch of the Thai immigration amnesty here in the second week of September, I am going to go ahead and prioritize Thai immigration news probably for the forthcoming couple of weeks. So just for view regular viewers, this will, a lot of things we're going to be doing is going to pertain to inside of Thailand's immigration, so the immigration apparatus within the kingdom. I will be doing videos, though, as and when needed on information for those trying to travel into Thailand because we do know that there's a lot going on with respect to that. And as there, if there are major events that arise with respect to U.S. immigration, we'll try to get to that as well. But I just want to be clear, we're going to kind of try to prioritize what's going on with Thai immigration internally because I suspect that that's going to have the biggest impact, the most dire impact on folks who are here in the kingdom as, the, you know, just here in the kingdom generally. Also, it's, it's worth noting that I think that there's a lot of good information sources out there, and I'm going to be citing some of them. You know, there, there's many. And, but that stated, information for those here in Thailand is really fluid. We're trying to keep up with this as best we can. If it is pertinent one minute but goes out of date this, the next, sorry about that, but we're trying to do this as best we can. A recent article, so to start this off, we're talking about the Thai immigration apparatus made a lot of announcements last week, and we've been researching all of that and trying to deal with context that we have there when we deal with immigration just generally sort of this routine course of business throughout our operation here. The and trying to confirm and firm up some of what's been said. But long story short, there's been some talk that on September 15th, there may be further announcements regarding ongoing issues pertaining to Thai immigration. A recent article from the Thai Examiner, that's thaiexaminer.com, article is titled Visa Amnesty to End with 30-Day Extensions on a the Focus Moves to Long Stay Visa holders. So, sorry, excuse me. Visa amnesty to end with 30 day extensions on application as the focus moves to long stay visa holders. And I urge you to, if you're watching this video, check out that, that article directly. It's quite long, a lot of information in there. Thai Examiner, yet again, very exhaustive in providing as much insight as they can into this issue. But one thing that came up that I thought was interesting, quoting directly, Senior Phuket immigration official says some news is in the pipeline for long-stay visa foreigners after September 15th from Bangkok. Earlier this week, a top immigration officer in Phuket, Lieutenant Colonel Udong Tong Chin, who is the deputy commander on the island, indicated that some news for long-stay foreigners within Thailand is in the offing. The, normal, the normally prescient official told the Phuket news, newspaper in Phuket that he expects some news from Bangkok prior to September 15th. So I went ahead, we, we went ahead and went to Phuket News, and that there is an article from Phuket News titled, Tourists to get unlimited 30-day extensions to stay after visa amnesty ends. And quoting directly from that article, Phuket Immigration Deputy Chief Lieutenant Colonel Udom Tongchen on Tuesday, September 1, urged any foreigners caught out by the income requirement to delay filing their applications to September 15th. Lieutenant Colonel Udom said he expected Immigration Bureau superiors to make an announcement by then. So the there, there apparently is information this, this particular colonel was cited as saying that there could be an announcement on Thai immigration matters. Now, September 15th, the amnesty ends on the 26th. So, honestly, 11 days is not a lot of time to rectify immigration status. If you are currently out of status, probably a good idea 
to do take best efforts to go ahead and rectify that status. But it remains to be seen, at least as of the time of this video, any substantive changes to immigration protocols regarding long-stay visas. That stated, again, the amnesty is yet to end, but in fact, information quite to the contrary of there being some sort of grand amnesty for all visa holders, in fact, it looks more like folks who are here in non-immigrant status and got caught in the amnesty, those folks are gonna to need to look at regularizing your status sooner rather than later, and I'm going to go ahead and make some videos on that topic in contemporaneously with this one, and we'll release them as soon as we can.